Hey guys, we're here again today, hard racing, doing our 2015 Yamaha R3 project bike. And today we're going to be installing this BMC high flow air filter. BMC uses a oil impregnated cotton woven filter, one of the top quality filters on the market. They've been making filters for a long, long time for just about every kind of motor vehicle on the planet, cars, motorcycles and definitely increases the airflow of the bike increases the performance of the bike really nice is that it's washable so you don't ever really have to buy a new one you just uh, spray you can get some of the air filter cleaner at your local AutoZone, walmart pet boys whatnot and you just spray it on there let it sit for a little bit hose it off and then spray the oil back on and toss it back in the bike so one filter pretty much for the life of your bike so it definitely pays itself off after just one or two filter changes. And of course, the best part about it is more airflow. More air, more power. And this one, because it is pretty small, is actually very, very inexpensive compared to what traditional air filters cost. So, And we're going to show you today how quick and easy it is to install this on the Yamaha R3. Probably one of the easiest, fastest air filter swaps you're ever going to see for a motorcycle. So the first step is going to be removing the side cover. And now we're going to take off the side cover from the air box. And obviously be careful when you're removing these not to drop them. And next, we're going to go ahead and take out the stock filter. So next, we're going to go ahead and prepare the filter for installation. And we do that by taking the foam gasket and installing it on the surface. But we first have to clean it off, clean the surface off with the alcohol to clean off any residue or oil. So next you go ahead and install the gasket, the foam gasket as shown here. Okay, and after you install the foam gasket, it's a good idea to go ahead and turn it upside down and push it against a flat surface. And that way the foam gasket will adhere to the filter. Okay, so next we're gonna install the filter and Real important, inside there is a lip. When you install the filter, you need to make sure that the filter goes underneath that lip. And on the other side, on the cover, it has the same type of lip, and that's going to give pressure on the filter to keep it sealed once it's installed. Okay, so we're going to go ahead and install the filter, and once it's almost all the way in, what you want to do is give it a little bit of pressure, push down, and then slide it underneath that lip. Okay, so next we're going to reinstall the cover. Now, uh, as you put the cover back on, you're going to start from the bottom and then just tilt it inwards. And that way that lip catches on the filter and it puts everything in place. And then you can put your bolts back on. And 
And last step is to reinstall your side cover. So now that you've got your BMC filter installed, last step is to put on the sticker. Install your sticker and it's good for about another one to two horsepower. So that's how super quick and easy it is to install a BMC air filter on your Yamaha R3. So if you have any questions or for more information, just give us a call or go on our website at hardracing.com.